Welcome to this video with Dr. Annex. The topic today is your most common questions and answers about coronavirus. What is a coronavirus? The term coronavirus refers to a large family of viruses that make people sick. Most of these viruses cause the common cold and are very prevalent. Less common strains of coronavirus also cause Middle East Respiratory Syndrome MERS, and Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome SARS, which are serious variations of the virus. COVID-19 is a new, rare type of coronavirus that began in Wuhan, China in December of 2019. COVID-19 is a new coronavirus, meaning that it hasn't been seen in people before and as a respiratory syndrome, meaning that it causes you to have difficulty breathing. In some cases, it can cause pneumonia. What are the symptoms of COVID-19? Most people who get COVID-19 have few to no symptoms. You might think you have a cold or the flu and be better in a few days. However, up to 1 in 5 people who get coronavirus will become seriously ill and may have trouble breathing. Symptoms to watch for include Fever Cough Shortness of breath Difficulty breathing If you have these symptoms but have not been in close contact with anyone who has COVID-19, you probably just have a cold or the flu. However, it's still a good idea to isolate yourself until your symptoms have passed. If you get COVID-19, are you going to die? Not likely. Although COVID-19 seems to be more deadly than more common diseases, such as the flu, the fatality rate has been estimated to be around 3.4% as of March 2020. Most cases are mild, but patients who are elderly or already battling a chronic disease or condition typically get hit the hardest. Around 81% of all cases of COVID-19 don't result in pneumonia or only mild pneumonia. Compared to SARS, severe acute respiratory syndrome, another coronavirus, COVID-19 is more easily transmissible but not nearly as deadly. Where did COVID-19 come from? COVID-19 was first identified in Wuhan City, Hubei Province, China in 2019. Although the first infections were linked to a live animal market, the disease is now spread person to person. Can you get COVID-19 from products shipped from China? Not likely. Although a lot is unknown about COVID-19, it doesn't appear that the virus can survive on dry surfaces, such as paper, plastic, or cardboard. Any products shipped from China should be safe to use without risk of contracting the disease. Even if someone with COVID-19 had coughed or sneezed on products before shipping them, it is unlikely that the virus would survive through the shipping process to infect another person. How can I fight the stigma associated with COVID-19? Help educate those around you about the fact that, although COVID-19 might have first been discovered in China, the disease itself doesn't target specific races of people. Nor are particular races more likely to get it than others. In fact, countries across the world, including most of Europe and the United States, have confirmed cases of coronavirus. It affects people of diverse populations, and anyone can catch it. Chinese and Asian people who you meet are no more likely to be infected than someone of any other race, unless they recently returned from China or were around someone who is sick. Tell people that the disease is spread person to person through close contact. Even though the disease originated in China, you're not at risk of getting the disease if you, for example, go to a Chinese restaurant or shop at a Chinese-owned business. Will the COVID-19 outbreak stop when the weather gets warmer? Many viruses, such as the flu, do not spread as rapidly in spring and summer months. However, since COVID-19 is a new virus, scientists don't yet know what will happen once the weather gets warmer. While you can speculate that the threat would dissipate with warmer temperatures, no one knows for sure if that will happen. 
Even if the virus does dissipate with warmer weather, there is also a chance it could return when the weather cools again in the fall and winter. Thank you for your attention. I'm Dr. Annex, see you again.